installing the gas tank. Prepare to install the gas tank. Gather the following. A gas tank, pipe thread compound, fuel petcock or valve, straps, M5 lock and flat washers, M5 nuts, 3 16 inch gas line, old bike tire tube, thread lock, heavy duty shears, and the 8mm wrenches. Fuel filter, 14 millimeter wrench. Add pipe thread compound around the threads of the petcock for a good seal. Screw petcock into the gas tank. Carefully tighten petcock with a 14 mm wrench. Wipe off excess thread compound. Make sure petcock is positioned so that it can open and close freely on the bike frame. Loosely secure one end of the fastening straps on tank studs with flat and cut washers and nuts. Add a double fold of old bike tire tube along the length of the gas tank bottom to act as a vibration dampener. Cut off excess tube. Evenly position the tube down the bottom center of the tank. Connect the ends of the mounting straps to the other tank studs. Secure with washers, nuts, and thread lock. Evenly tighten all nuts for each stud. Don't over tighten. If the provided straps are too short, the steel strap can be made into straps long enough for wide frame bikes. Cut two segments to a desired length. Snip off sharp corners. Using the channel locks or vise, bend the ends with the last holes at 90 degrees. Install the gas line and fuel filter. Insert a length of gas line through the top of the fuel filter. Estimate how much gas line is needed between the filter and petcock. Cut off excess gas line. Connect gas line to the bottom of the filter. Insert the top line into the petcock and estimate where to cut the bottom line. Cut the bottom fuel line. Insert the bottom fuel line into the carburetor fuel intake. Next video, part 12.
installing the exhaust.